Hey guys and welcome back to Season Communication Department. We are crawling around trying to avoid the security services who are desperately, desperately trying to get their way to the same place that I am. We have heard that the Terence, that is my vehicle that got, brought me here, well it's not my vehicle, it's the vehicle that brought me here and therefore I have taken ownership of it, uh, is somewhere outside and the captain, I can't remember the captain's name, I'm so sorry for that, is radioing in and trying to, uh, try to help. Trying to help, it's a, it's a worthy cause. But the security service has been like, ah, there's a vessel over there. We can get ourselves off of this ship. And so they're going to do so. And they're going to try and do it by force, which uh, it's not the best way to do things, if you ask me. You know, the, 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 the captain out there, she just wants to help. There's no, no reason to do Oh, there's nothing come out of there. There's no reason to do it by force. Um, she, she would just take everyone anyway. Oh, hello. What have we got here? This, this, this is the stuff I'm looking for. Is that making enough noise to cause any trouble, though? I don't think so. What have we got? Injectors, flashlight batteries. We're at the maximum of sensors. Well, let's get into this menu here. What, where can we put some sensors? To a noisemaker, maybe? The noisemakers are quite good. I like the noisemakers. Let's, let's make some of those. We are completely out of ethanol. Hey, look at that. Obviously, it's been a hard time since I arrived here, so um, I've, been, I've been knocking back the drinks like you wouldn't believe. Now, I do believe somewhere in here... This is where uh, Ricardo okay. is. Listen, Marlowe's permissions are still locked at this terminal. If we had the coordinates for the torrents, we could align the transmitter dishes manually, bypass Apollo completely. There's an observatory near the comms array, right? Yeah. You should be able to find the torrents coordinates using that. All right. What door? This door? Which door? Okay, so we have to go to an observatory, which is all the way down this way. So we go through here, through all this place. The comms... Oh, it's, it's, it's just... It's just what we need to go right. That, that's the direction that I picked up from there. No, no, I'm looking the wrong direction. I'm coming down south, so we need to go left, which is this way. All right, with my trusty flamethrower in hand and a suspicious nature about any person that I meet, we will go and go forth and try and do our best. Uh, <laughs> however, our best turns out. I have a feeling that our best is going to turn out in death, at least once. At least once. There's a vent there. Where does that vent go? Should we go and find out? Do we have it on our map? This is the question. This is the question. Ventilation access. Uh, do we... It got, oh, it doesn't go the way I want it to go. All right, well, we're not going to go that way. It's locked anyway, so that that's all right. So we're going to the comms control. Who knows what we're going to see in there? Who knows? And it's an elevator? What? Hey? What? Doesn't tell me it's an elevator here. Oh, it kind of does. Kind of does. Okay. Well, I, just, the thing is, I still have no idea what most of the uh, the legends on the map are about. No idea at all. I mean, I know this is a locked door, and I know this is a save point, but, like, orange exclamation mark? Could be anything. Could be anything. All right, so we've called the elevator. Come on, let me in. I really don't want to... That could have been full of aliens there, and that, that would have been terrible. All right, let's go through here. Why can't I use this door? It appears that, like, there is... Look, it would let me out that way, and this is kind of where we're going, right? I, I don't know. I don't know. Strangeness. So... How well do you know your long haul sex partner? Uh, long enough. Uh, well enough. I presume this is some sort of like anti gonorrhea poster. Hey, what have we got going on here? We got a save point. Let's um, let's do that. Is that uh? No, I thought I thought I saw a working Joe there. All right, well let's save the game and get, give ourselves a bit of an explore around. Because who knows what's here? Uh, I I got a feeling I've been here before, but I can't quite remember. Can't quite remember. Let's uh, just go around and have a crawl around. Yeah, yeah, no, I think I've, there's going to be a table on the right here that I hid under, that over there. Yeah, no, I've been here before. I've been here before. There's the comms dish. That means there's a working Joe down in that pit. Oh, no. Keep on it. That ship's out there waiting for us. Apollo won't let me in. Try your codes again. Okay. Okay. Wow, people talking. Uh, I'm not sure where they're talking. Uh, should we try and just stick our head up? We press control and up. Okay, there are people there. A uh, little bit worried about that. A little bit worried. Where's the observatory? We need to go that way. Okay, we can do that. I haven't been that way before. Hopefully we can just kind of sneak around here without getting spotted. That's lovely. Look at the view of the planet. It's a bit great. I love these things. Ah, oh, it's a dead end. This is not... Should we go through these vents? I've got a feeling the vent is what we're supposed to do here. Um, 
Nice, nice, nice spacious activities here. Or spacious, spacious place for activities. That's the that's the phrase I was looking for there. A uh, little bit worried about the security. So I mean, uh, who are they? I thought I was with the the security services, like the marshals, right? Who who are these people? Is this not a way through? Ooh. Am I safe? Where are people? People are behind me. That's okay. That's okay. We just kind of crawl our way up here. Keeping totally hidden, and if you know anything goes wrong, we'll just flamethrower anyone. Because you know, not only are aliens afraid of flamethrowers, but I think people are a bit afraid of getting set on fire as well. I know I am. Um, wow, of, of all the things that I could think of that could happen to me, being set on fire, it's not it's not really top of my priorities. So we are coming around here. We've got somewhere to cut, cut, cut. We're going to cut this open. Brilliant. Of course, using our shiny new ion torch that for some reason is bright as the seven blazes of hell. I don't know. It's just come around. Brilliant. I mean, I know it's an ion torch, but, you know, ions don't necessarily mean hot. Not necessarily, surely. I mean, it's just, you know, something that's been stripped of electrons, right? Have, have I got that right? Am I right? I don't know. Who knows what's going on. Okay, we are in somewhere with a ladder. Is this uh, an observation deck here? Hi, what's going on? There's no one dead in the chair. This is a bit odd. Maybe there's someone dead in that chair. Oh, look, there is. Hi. You always know in this game, if there's some chairs around, there's going to be a dead body to search. He got shot. Look at that. That's, that's not an alien burst out of him. He got shot in the chest twice. All right, what's going on here? Can we use this? You can't use this. So I guess... Sorry, it must have been me that I was here moving around. I guess what we're going to have to do is go up this ladder and go see what we can find. Um, who knows? Yeah, I, I don't know what we're going to find up here. Supposedly we're going for an observatory, so I'm imagining we're going to Ooh, find a great big window. Hey, look at those dishes out there. Great. Where, where is the Terence? Can we spot? I can't see it anywhere. And to be honest, all of, I can't really see much sort of up in that direction. I think there's the outline of a, of a station up there, but I can't know. Who knows? Who knows? All right, we're going to have a look around it. There we go. Bright green things are what one we're looking for. Anything worth... I've got to stand up. Anything worth st stealing? Oh, you know, like a tape. We're in the future. Why have we got a magnetic tape here? What is, what is going on? Like, I, I barely remember what one of those things is. I don't know. All right, let's activate the observation. Uh, match input with move keys and enter to confirm. No. That one, that one, that one. I don't know, that, that. I don't know what we're supposed to do. Okay, so you press across and hit enter when they're there. Oh, maybe not. No. Ah. <laughs> okay, let's... I don't know, we've got... Ah, come on, hang around for more than a little bit of time. There we go. Alright, we've got to wait for the next one. Overlock fail. Let's just try and hold down a direction and get it when it's there. It's bottom one, or the side one. Ah! Ah! Why would you do this to me? Go on, click over. Brilliant. Now, this one. No. Yes. Yes. And then finally, finally... Brilliant. Oh, that was that was actually difficult. They kept on blinking on and off quicker than I could. Okay, so that is... No, we don't appear to have done anything. I wish that sun wasn't quite glaring as strong as that. And so, oh, look, we can watch it, like... We can watch it flare. You see all the promontories coming on and off and stuff. I don't want to look directly at it, because, like, glare. But, yeah, that, that was nice. All right, commence deep space scan. Oh, wow. What are, we, what are we doing here? Control, docking alignment, press enter to engage. Oh, I've got to wait for the circle to meet the same size, do you reckon? I mean, I seem central, but we'll, we'll see what's going on here. Like this. It seems a bit weird, like, aligning a dish through a docking process. Does that look good? Looks good to me. The things move. No, we're moving. Uh, wait, I didn't want to. I was hoping to move those those things down. Where are we going? What's going on? Death, death is coming for us. I, I don't know. I, I don't think death is coming for us. But I, I really, I've just learned in this game that if anything different is happening, it's probably going to end up with some death somewhere along the line. Okay, we're going to commence deep space scan number two. Uh, something like this. Just look straight at it, shall we? We got. Is that a count down up top? No, that's a count up up top. Okay, we're going to try and just get it a little bit more central, like that. Brilliant. I don't know if we've got to be that exact. But... Ricardo, I found them. I, f I got it. I did it. 
Colin's position manually. Uh, yeah, how do we do that? I'm going outside. Outside? Uh, what? What, out there? I mean, as nice as that would be, it's like death of space out there. Voids and droppiness and oh, all sorts of things that I don't want. Is this opened up again? This has. Okay. Let's, um... No, we've got to climb from this side, have we? I'm too used to games where I can just kind of chuck myself in from the other side. All right. So we've got 450 flamethrower fuels. That's pretty good. Um, where else can we go? Where else can we go? There's obviously an exit somewhere. This way. It's not going to tell us where. Let's have a look in. What is this? How do we get out there? How do we get out there? There's going to be an unlocked door somewhere now, right? Uh, we're just going to fo follow this marker around. It's, it's the thing that I don't do all that often, but have to do a bit more often. Do you reckon that's I what the... Unlock the entrance to the airlock from here. Give me a sec. What air Is this the airlock? Is this an airlock? Doesn't look like an airlock. Oh, look. Maybe, maybe it is. Maybe it is. Okay, warning. Let's read this warning. Uh, oh, wait. I can't actually see what the warning is trying to... Arc, flash, and shock hazard. Appropriate PPE required. Do we have the appropriate PPE? Do I, where, where's my rubber suit? Uh, we can hide in there, or we can go and press this button. I think that's what we're going to do. I think that's what we're going to do. I do kind of want a rubber suit, though. Where, where do you reckon I get one from? Where do you reckon? Oh, look, there's some uh, some Seagun stuff. Our synthetics are built, not created. Seagun, tomorrow, together. Yeah. Uh, before they break, track and exterminate. Oh, it's supposed to be for killing rats, is it? Is that what this is for? Catching rats? Seems a little bit overpowered to me. Seems a little bit overpowered. Right, there, there is a save point. We're going to uh, do that before we get on our our equipment. Come on, save it up. Yeah. So, spacesuit. I believe the spacesuit is appropriate PPE. Shall we, uh, shall we do that? Uh, well, I'm not going out without a spacesuit. I, I don't know whose idea that was, but it's just not going to happen. Just uh, clock the reflection in the in the helmet there. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Okay, where are we going? What are we doing? We've got this on. Can we not just, like, purge the entire station now? That, that would be nice. Is this somewhere we can go now? Uh, this is rubbish visibility. I've got to say, can't really see much in my peripherals. Yeah, it's a helmet. That's, that's going to be the way things work. But... Mm, mm, could do with a bit more view. Hey, what's going on here? What are you about? Oh, the door's open. Great. How do we cycle this airlock? Oh, no. I'm, I, I can't look any further than this. Obviously, is the way we're supposed to be looking. Well, here we go. Out into... I don't like it. I I don't like it. Look, look at all this stuff coming out. Is Sebastopol? I can't even run. I can't even run. I mean, is it worth just crouching? I don't know. I don't know. We're just going to kind of carry on along this way. I really can't go any faster. This this is the speed I'm allowed to go at. Are we headed towards the atmosphere then? I, I don't understand how it reckons we're just like randomly falling. Where, where is Sebastopol in relation to this planet? I mean, are we are in orbit or are we not? Like, if we're in orbit, then there's no problem. We're just going to stay here. Uh, if we're not going fast enough to be in orbit, how did we stay up here? That's what I want to know. Obviously some sort of electronic process because, you know, the electronics are failing and that's why we're falling. Oh, jeez, look at that. Wow. <laughs> that's nice. Is that going to crash into uh, anything from our friends? Like, that, that's where all our people are, right? Down that way. That that would be terrible. God, that, that lens glare stuff at the sides there. Look at that. Chromatic aberration, is it? I believe that's what it's called, when the, the whole curved surface makes things look different. All right, so here we are, dish maintenance. Are there things to do here? Look, we're going to have to power up some, some stuff, aren't we? This is not what I need to do. Looking for something that is flashing or something like... Yeah, yeah, like that. That, that looks like it's flat. Why did that just suddenly start glowing? Are we as far along as we can get here? Yeah, we kind of are. We kind of are. Okay, let's get into this... What keeps glowing up? And more importantly, why why am I safe from that? What's going on? Oh, crouch. Crouch. Do I have a flamethrower? I do not have a flamethrower. I, I don't have access to anything in my in my spacesuit. What's going on with that? What is going on with that? Okay, let's uh, move out to... The the terminal. What terminal? Where's the terminal? What? 
Maintenance, maintenance, movement. Uh, there are lots of buttons that look. Input terrain coordinates. There we go. We'll, we'll do this. Don't, like I was saying, there are lots of buttons to press, but I don't really see what's going on. Which direction? Which inclination? This is the question. Which one? Damn it! What? How do I, how do I move it? Which is? Remove parabolic antenna. Stuff. I'm, I'm guessing I've got to go down here because there's not really any other. Yeah, yeah. This is the way I got to do. Uh, so we've manually input the terrain coordinates. We've already done that. We've already done that. So let's carry on walking down here. Uh, parabolic antenna. Now, which one of these many do you reckon is the parabolic antenna they're talking about? Probably this one. This is where where the the gangway, walkway, whatever this is called, seems to be leading. I really wish I could run when I was out here. I mean, I know it's not quite the atmosphere they're going for. Where is all this stuff coming from? I'm behind a wall. Wow. Occultation um, coding really needs a bit of work in this, in this game, doesn't it? Really does. Uh, can we put some lights on? No, we can't put any lights on. All right, well, we'll just have to wander around to see what we can find. Uh, it's very dark in here. No, no lights at all. I do see these, though. Okay, let's um, go down to the last one if we can. No, we've got to do them in order. No? No? Okay. What's this over here, then? Uh, unlock emergency clamp. Still can't do that. What's this? Is this power? Um, uh, I can't really see what we're looking for here. Um, there we go. What's this? What's this? We have reboot array clamp controls. That's what we want. We're going for a system reboot, right? Flashing light. I like the flashing light. It gives me... Uh, Gives me hope. Power clamp release, power clamp release. Uh, no, are we still not doing stuff? Are we waiting just for this to finish doing its thing? Oh, well, look, it went back in. Ooh, almost sexual, right? Okay, we got some flashy light. Oh, and that is almost sexy. Look at that. Mm -mm. Oh, oh wow. what are we looking at? Hey! What's going on out here? A lot of, lot of white out. That's what's going on out there. Uh, we can't unlock that one. Nor this. That one. What are we doing? We're holding right mouse, button, right mouse button and pulling the levers down. It's pretty standard. Pretty standard. Um, they've been following the same sort of procedures throughout the entirety of this game. It's almost as if like all the uh, all the controls were made by the same person or something. I don't know. Or at least the same company, right? At least the same company. Uh, it's all done by Seekson. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Finally, we're going to pull these down, and hopefully we should be able to see stuff moving now. Yeah, look at that. Oh, it's, it's amazing. Giant things on the move. What, what's, what's that? That looks like that would take my head off before I even look at it. Okay, so we are pointing the dish in the right way. The, the real question here is what's going to stop uh, the bad guys talking to her and kind of like guiding her in now? This is what I want to know. This is what I want to know. Okay, let's um, go outside and have a look at what we can see. Do we get to see this moving around? Ah, I can't see the stuff in the way. Why would... The ah, that sounded like a lock being put in place. Yeah, it's stopped moving. It's stopped moving. Let's try and um, let's try and put in those coordinates again, shall we? It's a shame we can't see anything move. Ooh. Oh, I thought, I thought the station was falling apart there when I looked down and things were moving. Oh, no. Well, everything's looking all right, looking all good up here. That sun is beautiful. Right, maybe we can just do this again, and then then, and then it will be happy days, and we can input the coordinates, and, and and we'll go talk to people. I don't know what the coordinates are. Listening, listening, listening. I'm really not sure how we're supposed to like. What what do we know? Do, do we know anything? Coordinate, uh, Terence coordinates components. Uh, 35 maybe. Let's, let's try 35. Let's try 35, see what we get. Um, it's over, wrong way, it's over this way. Really no idea. I mean, all I can see is that little corner flashing in the corner there. Um, yeah, 35 is good, is it? Is that good? Is it not? 75. Oh, you see how it, on the screen on the left there is flashing a different number now. Uh, we ca we can just, just trust and pray in the power of flashing numbers. That's, that's all we can do. 75. We're getting close. About there. Mm, just a little bit, little bit further. About there. That looks good to me. 
All right. Is that everything we need? Let's look up. But no, you're not going to let me look up. There we go. I want, I want to watch that going around. Yeah. Is that it? Are we done now? Can we? Do we get to go back inside? Because I don't know. But I feel a little bit vulnerable out in space. It's just it just doesn't doesn't work well for me. Also, where is that all that noise coming from? Is it vibrating through the floor? You wouldn't expect it would be something that I could actually uh, feel or hear. Oh my god, the the noise, the noise. What is this? What's going on? Torrance, Torrance, this is Ripley on the station. Are you reading me, Verlaine? Verlaine. What the hell is going on over there? Death, doom, and destruction. Torrance, there's an alien organism here. It's deadly. We need urgent extraction. A what? There's no time to explain. Please, relax. Quarantine. Quarantine. No for us to dock, Ripley. The station's tearing free from its gravity mooring. Gravity mooring, I've hey. I've seen a towing platform below the space flight terminal, but the Torrens umbilical isn't built for it. Oh, wow. You'll need to extend the tow platform clamp station side. Just get into position. <laughs> well, here we go. Let's do it. Oh, well, that, that's the way. So, we need to <laughs> take this long-ass walk again. My God. Long ass walk. Is that literally all we're doing? He's getting back inside. Oh wow. Dish maintenance. Yeah, yeah. We we need to uh, find a way for the torrents to dock. Definitely going back to Ricardo. Oh look, it tells me to go find Ricardo and then find a way to Solomon's habitation town. Right. We know what we're doing. Let's get going. And I'm gonna have a little bit of a cough. <coughs> oh, excuse us about that. All right. Cool. Just walking on. Let me off. I want to jump. Why won't you let me jump? I just need to walk out. There we go. Okay, we are just walking our way down here. Can I not, like, input some, some controls on this one? No. Maybe beam a message back to Earth. Be like, more ha ha. Silly Waylon Yutani. Always, always trying to get us in trouble. Um, I don't know. I mean, you would have thought after some time they'd start giving the Ripley family a bit of, like, I don't know, shares in the company or something with everything they've been doing. You know, just give them a couple of a couple of thousand shares, something like that. And just just wait. Just wait. I mean, by the time uh, Ellen Ripley comes out of the deep space that she's currently in, deep sleep, sorry, that she's currently in, she'll be uh, 50 years of interest and growth better off, right? That's how it works, yeah? I mean, as it is, I'm a lot older than 11, so she's already been out there for a while. A while, a while, a while. Just look at this. I love this. This is amazing. Is that the observation deck? That's the bit that went up and down, all right? Oh, that's cool. They should make a multiplayer version of this, just so I can stand here and watch that go up and down. That would be great. Oh, I, I would literally love that. I would literally love that. Is that a gun? What do you reckon those sticky out bits things are? Probably communication stuff, right? Probably communication stuff. Then why did we need to point the dish? Then why did we need to point the dish? I am going to go out on a limb and say that is obviously a plasma gun. <laughs> Despite the fact that nothing on this vessel, on this uh, space station, seems to be, uh, so what I'm looking for, aggressive, offensive, anything like that. Oh god, wait for the airlock to cycle again. Always the worst bit. Always the worst bit. All right, so let's get in here. Let's put our thing away, and I will say. Thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, guys. I'm going to see you next time where we're going to go and find out how the hell we can get the Torrens docking into this position, uh, onto this station. It, it, it's a small small docking clamp that we need to use. We'll see what's going on. But anyway, I will see you then when we're going to do that. Bye!